What's up, everybody? So this is kind of an interesting thing, right? So I have the OnePlus Nord N200 5G. And currently right now, I threw the visible SIM card in it. And it's actually connected. And it's actually connected to 5G, which is weird because the OnePlus Nord N10 unlocked would not pick up 5G connection on any other carrier unless it was a T-Mobile carrier. So kind of interesting. Um, so I'll do a quick speed test here. And while I decided to do this, just basically I thought I would give my pixels a break. So um, yeah, I'm just not going to be using Google Pixels for a little, little bit of time. So anyways, this is the only downside to it, right? Um, so it's actually only just picking up like, you know, 140 down, which is not bad for download speeds. And the uplink is pretty decent too. I mean, that's pretty decent speeds for an uplink. So yeah, um, the OnePlus N200, I'm going to use Visible on. And then the Moto G Stylus, I'm using uh, my Metro line on. So yeah, still kept the Metro line. Well, kept one of them. Uh, but anyways, yeah, these aren't bad speeds at all. So give me my Google Pixels a break. I'm going to stay behind at home. And using something different. Which, honestly, I kind of like the OnePlus. So, yeah, it's going to be my main uh, daily driver for a little bit of time. As well as the Moto G Stylus that I'm recording this video on. So if you guys enjoyed this video, y'all know what to do. Smash the like button because it really helps out. And, yeah, um, this is the Metro version of the OnePlus N200. And uh, it is unlocked, so it's no longer carrier, carrier locked. Um, whoever had it before me literally... Um, uh, had this phone bought like over six months ago because yeah, it's sim unlocked. Anyways, that's it. Thanks for checking out the video. And as always, law.